Essie's Figure Arts, Marvel Studios, Shang-Chi, Legend of the Ten Rings, Essie's Figure Arts, Shang-Chi from Marvel Studios, Shang-Chi in the Legend of the Ten Rings movie. Here he is in the packaging again, right here. Pretty sick, right here in the packaging again, right here. Marvel Studios, Shang-Chi, Legend of the Ten Rings, Essie's Figure Arts, Midnight Tomashi Nations, Essie's Figure Arts, Shang-Chi. Side right here, looking pretty sick right here. Back of the packaging again, right here. Here's in the back of the packaging again, right here, looking pretty sick right here. And then there's the figure right here, looking pretty dope right here. Top SC's figure at Shang Chi. Here he is in the packaging again right here, looking pretty dope right here, again right here. But yeah, let's get this guy to the packaging and take a look at him. Okay, there's Shang Chi, right? Yes, this figure is Shang Chi from the Shang Chi and the Ten Rings movie. Here he is next to the Marvel Legends one, custom Marvel Legends one. Here's how those two look together. You know, right here, you see that one's taller than the Shang Chi Arts one, but yeah, they both look pretty sick right there and right there. Some uh, Shang Chi Marvel Legends one. This is my other custom one. With the stuff. Let me try to position it. But here are the two right here looking pretty sick next to each other. We have them hold the stuff like this, but yeah. Here's how they look together. Again, right here looking pretty sick next to each other. Again, right here. Yeah, this guy looks amazing. Again, right here, this is his figure at Shang Chi from the Shang Chi Legend of the Ten Rings movie. This figure looks fantastic. A couple of figures to compare this guy to. Here is Bucky Barnes from Falcon Wars Soldier Shang Chi figure. Here's how these two stack up. 
Yeah, and right here, as you can see, he's a little bit taller than Bucky Barnes from Falcon Winter Soldier, but yeah. We fought great together again right here. And then we compare him to my custom Wendell figure, Marvel Legends figure. Here's how they look together again right here. Pretty sick again right here. And here is Shai Ling, his sister, and here he is next to Shai Ling, his sister. Here's how they look together again right here, looking pretty sick right here. But yeah, this figure looks incredibly detailed. Again right here. Definitely looks fantastic again right here on the figure itself. All the accessories it comes with as well. Do you like that head sculpt again right here? Nice detail on the head sculpt. And nice detail on the texture of the suit. Right here on the bottom of the shoes. Right here, nice red. And right here. It's really like really nice texturing on the suit. Again, right here. Nice detail on that head sculpt right here. It's all the nice texturing on the suit. It's all the nice texturing on the suit and the back. All, all the lines. That nice texturing on the figure itself. Again, right here, looking pretty sick right here. So all the nice texturing on the shoes, again, right here. Yeah, this figure definitely looks fantastic. Again, right here, really do like how this guy looks. You can give him the extra hands that you can give him to pose him out, however you want to pose him out. looks nice <clears throat> you can have him with one hand with the weapon he comes with which actually looks pretty sick you can give him his staff or I guess or the staff weapon There is with the staff, nice red detail on the staff right here. I'm kind of going to try to have him post that with this. It's kind of how I'm going to have him post that like this kind of. But yeah, there he is, pulls out with the weapon. You know, here in this figure looks fantastic again right here. Have, like all the nice sculpt detail. And right on the figure itself, on the texture and the suit. Again right here. It's all the nice sculpt detail on the suit again right here. On the shoes, again right here. It's really nice texture on the figure. You can get this guy in some pretty decent poses. Again, right here. You can kind of recreate that scene when you have, I guess, Wenwu and him going at it. I guess. Kind of recreate that scene of the movie. It actually looks pretty sick. Again, right here. But yeah, my buff left one looks pretty sick again, right here. But yeah. But man, this figure looks incredibly detailed. Like, look at how the figure looks. 
I do, I do like how this guy looks. Again, right here, there's all the nice sculpted detail on the figure itself. All that nice sculpted detail on the figure. It just looks fantastic. I'm so, so glad to add this guy to my S figure arts collection. He definitely looks like a fantastic figure to have in your collection. And all the nice texturing on the suit. Again, right here, all that nice sculpted detail. Nice texture on the suit and that head sculpt again right here. See on the black pants and the shoe, black shoes look really shiny again right here. Back of the figure, all the nice texturing on the figure and the suit. This guy and the weapon looks incredible. Look at that nice red, shiny red on the handle. So look all that nice shiny red looking fantastic. This thing, this looks incredibly detailed. You definitely can get him into some pretty good poses. Again, right here. But yeah, this guy looks amazing with his weapon. It definitely looks fant a fantastic figure to have in your collection. You can also have him like with an angry head if you want. You can take off this head and you can take off his weapon. Take off his weapon and take off this head. You can have him like with like, like, like his serious head, I guess. Uh, you gonna... Yeah, you gonna, let me, uh, real quick, let me, uh, That's how you do it, you gotta, you should have pulled the thing apart, I guess. This is interesting because. You gotta pull this apart and then you gotta attach this. And then that's how you, the other head, this looks nice. There it is, there it is on there. This looks incredible. Just look at that head sculpt right here. You can even get him into some pretty decent poses though. With the hands. So I'm not sure if I'll have him displayed like with the weapon, but maybe have him displayed like this maybe. I'm not too sure. something like this maybe I'm gonna have this fight like this maybe which looks looks incredible getting right here but yeah again like nice texturing on the suit let's get that nice texturing on the suit again right here nice red and all the metallic red it's nice texturing on the suit on the shoes bottom red on the shoes again right here this thing just looks fantastic, again right here. But yeah, this thing looks incredible. This texture on the suit and the sky just looks fantastic, again right here. It definitely looks like, like a great figure. I think, I think this guy was around like 45 bucks, which was not bad. And, and then the, the only other thing that would have made it better is if he came with like, like the 10 rings. But other than that, this thing looks incredible. It looks like a fantastic figure. Again, right here, you can get him into some pretty decent poses. Again, right here. Definitely get him into some pretty decent poses. Again, right here. But yeah, this guy looks fantastic. Again, right here. I'm so glad to have this guy in the collection. He looks incredible. He's next to alongside some other, some other SS figure arts figures. He's next to Ant Man. From Ant-Man and the Lost Ant-Man Quantumania. 
Here's how they stack up next to each other again right here, looking pretty sick right here. But yeah. See that looks amazing again right here. Just all the nice sculpt detail in the suit again right here. Just looks fantastic. This definitely looks like Shang-Chi for sure. Looks so screen accurate how you looked in the film. But yeah, all that nice sculpt detail back of the hair. All that nice sculpted detail again right here. This figure just looks phenomenal and incredible. We can get this guy into some pretty decent poses again right here. And yeah, I might have him displayed though, like with the weapon itself, just because I like the when we saw him with that weapon in the movie. I thought it was sick as heck. This figure though, I think looks incredible though. I just really like how the, the weapon looks. It just looks really nice. Again right here, just look at that figure itself. The figure just looks fantastic. Again right here. It's all that nice sculpted detail on the figure. Again, right here in the texturing of the figure. That weapon just looks, that red, that bright red just looks so metallic red. Look at that red again right here. But yeah, that weapon looks cool as well. You can have him hold the weapon, which actually looks pretty sick. Again, right here. But yeah, this guy looks incredible. Again, right here. This thing just looks incredibly detailed. Again, right here. But yeah. This guy just looks metallically sculpted detail. And the figure just looks phenomenal. Just all the nice sculpted detail. Again, right here. Just all that nice sculpted detail on the figure itself. And all that nice texturing on the figure itself. And right here, all that nice sculpted detail on the suit. All that nice sculpted detail. Get right here on the figure. You can get this guy into some pretty decent poses again right here. But yeah, I really do like how this figure looks. Again right here. But yeah, I really do like how it looks. And it just looks like, like a fantastic figure. A fantastic Essie's figure. Let's figure to have in you guys' collection. And yeah. I just enjoyed this video and coming up next guys we're gonna be reviewing uh another SS figure arts figure in the collection coming up next guys we're gonna be reviewing uh next guys we're gonna be reviewing uh marvel black widow SS figure arts marvel 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 from the black widow movie uh taskmaster so stay tuned for that video coming up soon, guys. And yeah, so remember to please subscribe, like this video, and have a great day. And please like this video and come in next to for more. And see you guys. Bye. Have a great day. And please like this video and see you guys. Bye.